Konnichiwa mina, boku wa Jeremy desu, yoroshiku onegaishimasu. And today I am both happy and sad to introduce to you a new member of my pet family, uh, my new betta fish, which means, well, it doesn't necessarily have to mean it, but it does mean in this case that unfortunately Deimos passed away. De Deimos was my longest living betta fish. <laughs> uh, as some of you know who've watched for a while, I've had lots of trouble keeping betta fish alive <laughs> for whatever reason, but Deimos was one that actually survived for quite a long time. And uh, so, unfortunately, he passed away yesterday. Uh, so I went to the pet store today and I was just looking around and stuff and, and I found a new betta fish friend um, and a new tank as well. So we'll see how this one works. I did not put plants in it because I did think that one of the reasons that Deimos was able to survive so long compared to the others was the plants that I had put in the other tanks were ripping away at his, um, or at their scales, or there might have been some weird stuff on the plants, even though I thoroughly washed them and so on and so forth. Now, uh, so this is the tank here, and I'll do a little bit of a close-up here if I can. Oops. Let's do this here. Okay, so this is our new fish. Let's see, there he is. His name is Hydra, and I named him after the uh, one of Pluto's moons, actually. Uh, Pluto's satellites, I should say, quote unquote. Uh, and the reason that they named that moon, or satellite, Hydra, is because it is in kind of an ode to Pluto's tenure as the ninth planet, which I still consider it to be the ninth planet, um, and the Hydra being the thing that Hercules had to battle against the nine-headed serpent. So ninth planet, ninth-headed serpent, this could even be my ninth beta, I honestly don't know. Um, he's got some really nice colors, and it's kind of hard to see. Let's see if the camera will... Oh, there we go. Yeah. White, blue, purple, like, he's all sorts of colors, and he's really nice, and I put some, it's, again, the color is weird, yellow rocks in there with some clear ones as well, so maybe a better thing from the top here. There he is. Uh, and this tank is kind of neat, because it's a self-cleaning tank of sorts, um, and it's supposed to have an LED light. Unfortunately, the one that I got doesn't seem to want to work when I plug it in, so I've left that out for now. And uh, he's just kind of chilling on my library um, shelf. And hopefully Fong and Bailey decide that they do not want to eat him for dinner. Because that would really suck. Anyway, so this is Hydra, my newest beta fish. And we'll see how he does. I hope he, he lives a good long life. And that he enjoys his tank. And yeah, I will... Update you guys as things come along, I suppose. Anyway, thank you very much. I will see you guys again sometime soon. Jamathani mina. Bye-bye.